Elon. Oh, I think I think Elon has uh, has left. Hello, everybody, and welcome to game night. Today is Friday, December the 16th. I'm joined by Anna, Theus, and Marlon. And I, first of all, want to thank everybody for helping me to get over the 100 subscribers. I am there. I am there. But we're not stopping because now 150 is the new goal. So I keep moving it out until I reach that thousand. So 150 now is what I'm going to start talking about. But thank you to everybody who has subscribed. I really, really, really appreciate it. And it was a nice surprise to get that 100 subscriber while I was live. That was a, just a really good thing to happen. Um, like this video. Share this video. Um, support us on Patreon. I want to really start talking about my Patreon because I only have five Patreons and I'm really want to get to 10. Um, so I'll be talking about subscribing and supporting me on Patreon. There's going to be a limited series that I will announce at the end of this broadcast. So I will tell everybody how today's game is going to work. We're gonna do um, <clears throat> questions and heads up everybody. All the answers are derived from the Bible, every single answer. If it's not, which I think there's one question that is not, I will say this does not come from the Bible. These are, I think, pretty simple questions. These are common knowledge questions. Each question is worth 10 points. And if it is a tie, I will ask um, the two people who are tied, or all three of you are tied, to come up with a cookie recipe and whichever one I think is the best, I will choose. So the point total is as follows. Marlon is in the lead with 130. Mm. Anna is in second place with 55. And C is bringing up the rear with 55. First, last place, baby. Okay, so here comes the first easy question of the night. Jesus' mother Mary was a virgin when she conceived and gave birth to him. Who or what was responsible for her conception? Well, God? who or what was responsible for her conception? Legend has it. According to the Bible, if you could use that. Oh, word. the angel oh, came the Holy down Ghost. and blessed him with the This that is correct. That answer is the Holy Spirit. That is correct. Which is interesting. Because no, nope, we're gonna Holy move on Spirit to the next question. Is part <laughs> we're moving on to the next question. The Holy Spirit overtook her, and that's how she conceived a child. Oh. That's in Matthew. So, see, Anna, where you end up okay. with a bit of the confusion is there's this thing. Well, I'm sure you're aware of this thing called a Trinity. So, in some <laughs> belief systems within Christianity, the Trinity is three parts of one. So it's still God who impregnated Mary, but he used himself in the form of the Holy Ghost to do it. So then later on, when Jesus leaves, the Holy Ghost come back to watch over and help us while Jesus, it, anyway. Next question. <laughs> The next question. Only, until the end, I was doing okay. You was doing good till you just got up until then, but you was doing good. You gave the right <laughs> answer. Question number two. Only two gospels include any details about the birth of Jesus. Which one of them starts with the genealogy to establish Jesus as Messiah? Well, the numbers. Which of the gospels? <clears throat> Matthews? That is correct, Marlon. And then there's the, the, the gospel of Luke. But that, that, that. Oh. Just, oh, in the left, okay. Luke, uh, 95 South. No, that was Luke chapter one and two, which tells Mary's end of the story. That's Mary Glenn. Why I got to do all this vacation Piper school trivia? Oh my goodness. Next question. How many, on, Chris, 
Yeah. How many days after the birth of Jesus did Mary and Joseph give his name? Huh? How many days? Let me read this question again. How many days after the birth of Jesus did Mary and Joseph give him his name? So, all right. So, what's funny about this is, see, there was this guy. Yes, who came can, I, can I give my answer? Then yes, please, go. Merlin. Five. That is incorrect. Okay. I'm um, thinking it's more like three because the Bible likes the number three. Also, three is not it, correct. It's not correct. Okay. It's not correct. So, so what had happened, right? Back then. Okay. So, Anna, do you have a guess at this? Just throw a number out. Just throw any number out. Ooh. The answer is eight. Eight days. You didn't let this baby sit around for eight <laughs> days. That was, Jewish that was Jewish custom back then to wait eight and days. Then, and then you turn around and name him Emmanuel, but don't nobody call him that. Some people do. Who call him that? Everybody mm -hmm. I know call him Jesus. I mean, Jesus. Or Yeshua. So, or Jehovah. Or God. No, because Jehovah's God. Jehovah and Yahweh are God. Okay. So and next then, question, only of the four Gospels, only one does not... four Gospels? Of the four I Gospels... There were two. Of the four Gospels, only one does not mention anything about Jesus' birth. Which one is it? Samuel. No, that's Old Testament. That's Old Testament. Perhaps if I named the Gospels, you could all think of them. There it was always Luke, there's Matthew, there's Matthew Mark, 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 Mark and, and, John. Luke and John. So I'm gonna okay. go with Mark. I'm gonna go with okay. Luke. Theus is correct. It is the Gospel. It's of always Christ. Mark, man. Mark was never paying attention. See, the other three was down for the cause, but Mark was all in his own thing, doing his own stuff. So I he didn't even tell the story. Okay. More. I thought by this time Luke was in Miami, so he wasn't paying, writing nothing down. Well, well okay. Marlon, think about it. See, like out west on the west coast, what did they call them. you when you are okay. like that member of the crew that don't do right? You Here's more, an Old Testament right? one. <laughs> Here's a question about Jesus from uh, the Christmas story from the Old Testament. What was Jesus the, wasn't in the Old Testament? What was the name of the prophet? Whom Christians believe predicted the birth of Mary's child. Oh, that'd be John the Baptist. I said Old Testament. That is John the Baptist baptized. Yes, right. John... But see, John the Baptist was born was the of the old people who weren't supposed to be but have children, and he was the precursor. So then he was already he was out ministering and that doing all that incorrect. stuff. And then when Jesus came closer to of age, we don't that let was you when Google John baptized him. Y'all getting some crazy answers. My answers are good. Y'all, I gave one crazy answer. All my answers have been good. Every answer I've given, except for the ones that weren't, have been extremely biblical. Except for the ones I weren't. The answer is the prophet Isaiah. See, I was going to say Isaiah. No, I wasn't. But you there. didn't. Next question. Because Isaiah, ain't that the one that was his daddy was going to kill him? You don't need to read the Bible, she said. You know all these answers, she said. Yes. But isn't Isaiah the one your daddy tried to kill him? Okay, okay. Here's one. Tracy. Hey, Anna, we, we, we both in the same boat, because unless you did something very popular. She probably, I, I, I she have a serious question. I and got a serious question. Gabriel was the angel who announced to Mary that she Why was... Why are you not answering my question? Because I'm trying to get to the next question. <laughs> Gabriel was the angel who announced to Mary that she would conceive and give birth to Jesus. What is the Hebrew translation of Gabriel? And I don't expect anybody to know this. He's the trumpet player. No. He's the messenger. Oh, you so close. You are yeah. so, but that's not the right answer. I used to, I used to actually pay attention to this stuff. The answer is God is my strength. I don't know how you get that out of what I said, but okay. What? Okay, John <laughs> the Baptist. John the Baptist is often referred to as Jesus's cousin. 
Which one of them is the older? John the Baptist. Baptist. John the Thank Baptist. you. But Thank wait a minute, going back to Gabriel. First of all, how is Gabriel is a is a is a angel? Eurocentric name? How how is it that the angel name is Gabriel? Because that's in John chapter four. And then I bring another chapter question: What was John's four, real name? Because it showed up wasn't John. It was an <laughs> Okay. okay. Oh, I didn't know his last name could not have been the Baptist. No, that was his title. The that Baptist. was his stage name. Oh, uh, like the baby. According to the Bible, this is an easy one. According to the Bible, Dr. Dre ain't a real doctor. Which animals were mentioned as being present when Jesus was born? Which animals sheep, are mentioned? Sheep. Sheep. Incorrect. There was a lamb. A lamb. Um, yeah. And a donkey. Okay. There was a donkey. That all of you are incorrect. No, that donkey was there because his parents rode the donkey into Bethlehem. Let me read the question again because let me read the question again. So they just going to park the donkey Bible, outside? That ain't how you treat your pets, man. According to the Bible, <laughs> which animals were specifically mentioned as being present in the stable when Jesus was born? In the cow. Stable. I'm going to go with a cow. A rabbit. A rabbit. Wrong, wrong and wrong. The answer is no animals are mentioned being present at the stable. How you gonna go and kick these animals out their house so you can have your baby? You know, see now I missed this part of the story. I didn't know that they were so that bad. Means you need to animals. familiarize yourself with the story. Next question: Who spread the news about baby Jesus throughout Bethlehem? Jack. AT and T. The star. Oh, Anna, you were so close. It's the shepherds. I thought it was no. Yeah. So the sweet. The three kings followed the star to find nope. where the baby was. That's two different right? things. That's two but different the shepherds, things. So the shepherds got there before the kings. Oh, okay, see, do not go on a yeah. long dissertation on this next question, but I'm gonna ask it anyway. Jesus Christ, our Savior, was born in Chris on Christmas Day from the Who's Carol. Savior? I'm just reading the question. <laughs> Jesus Christ, our Savior, was born on Christmas Day from the carol, God Rest Ye Merry Gentlemen. No date was given for the birth of Jesus in the Bible. So why does the world celebrate Christmas on December 25th? Because Christianity is actually kind of pagan. So what they did was mm -hmm. they took Easter and they took mm -hmm. Easter, which is about, about the, the time of, of recreation and growth and birth. And then they use that for the resurrection of the Christ because that shows rebirth and growth. And then with the Christmas, it we we took a pagan Christmas tree and with pagan traditions behind that. But it's Real. really kind of celebrating the renewal, right? Because Jesus was helping to bring yep. about the renewal of is of God's people. So that's why we do it in okay. I'm gonna period. give it to you, but I'm gonna give you points for that because that's that's the technical answer is in the absence of biblical basis for the time in the Christmas, the church seems to have adopted the pagan practice of a festival around the time of winter solace. This had the double advantage of being adopted. Time to celebrate. I wouldn't <laughs> use that word. Well, see, Anna, when, you, when you win, you can Come call on, it the <laughs> Okay, that's a question. Here is a true false question. Wait, That's like coming up on a car thing, and he's like, look at the I'm car sorry. I adopted. I'm sorry, y'all have adopted a lot of stuff. Y'all have the adoption of a full-grown orphanage of history. Y'all are killing me. Hey, you know, you guys got a lot of funny names. We're just going to change them real quick. And I'm That's what they did in English. Religion. They just changed them to English name. Next question. Name. It is a Not all of them. Name. Only the main People. character. It's All funny. the other characters. Okay, so the names. next question is a true or false God. question. True or false? <laughs> Jesus came to bring peace. Is that true or is that false? Uh, I'm going to have to go with false. Anna, what do you say? Jesus came to bring peace. Is that a true statement or a false statement? I, I'm going to go with true. Okay, Marlon, is it a true statement or a false statement? Say true. 
This is right again. Jesus did not come to bring peace. Matthew 10, verse 34 says he came with a sword. No, when he comes back, he's going to do that. But yeah, but he did because he came to disrupt these people who were bastardizing. And that's a, that's a good word. It's not a curse word. His, his, his father's law in, in the way of the faith. So he came to disrupt those who were okay, blaspheming. Now, look at here, uh, Reverend. We did not ask for a long dissertation. I just want the <laughs> end. I won't be a, I won't be before you long. Now, as I draw <laughs> to a close. Okay. okay, next question. Okay, we already asked that question. Oh, okay, this is the easy one. Easy, easy peasy. Which country? Did Joseph and Mary flee to because the angel told them? Bethlehem. What country? That's not a country, honey. Not Bethlehem. city, country. Bethlehem, Idaho. Um, See, now you're being silly. You know it's Oregon. Jordan? Oh, that's a state. No. No, no, no. Israel? No, he was born in Israel. These do you got to guess? Is it Syria? No, the answer is Egypt. Out of Egypt, I have called my son. Hold up. So Jesus was born in Egypt? No, I said Jesus was born Wait. in Bethlehem, but the angel told Joseph to take him to take him and Mary to Egypt, and that's where they lived for the first part of Jesus' life. Did he that where he went to elementary school? Okay. They didn't have elementary school. Back then. But didn't they still have to go to Bethlehem and pay their taxes every year? Can I ask a silly question? So Egypt is a country and Africa is a continent? Right. So there's countries within a continent? Yes. Okay. Yeah. okay. Like well, North well, America is a continent, United States. If is I a had continent. something, I would throw it at you right now. <laughs> Dude, I've been out of school a long time. I just want to make sure. <laughs> I'm just like, Bethlehem is not a country. <laughs> See, Bethlehem is named after Beth, who fell in love with Ham. Oh, my gosh. You got the next question. Oh, my goodness. Okay. <laughs> okay. I tell you, y'all pay attention to me. I know what I'm talking about. I know I sound like I'm being silly, but I know what I'm talking about. <laughs> According to the gospel. I want to be on Theus's team, please. <laughs> That's well, then who's gonna be with Marlon? Ain't nobody want to be with me. <laughs> at, this point, I don't, at this point, I don't want to be with me. So, according to the Gospel of Luke, why did Joseph have to travel to Bethlehem? Pay them taxes, Pay them one dog. More time. According to the Gospel of Luke, why did Joseph have to travel to Bethlehem? I just gave the answer. Marlon asked me to you. Yes. But Thea said it first, so he gets the point. Uh, so Thea has got 50 points. Killing it, dog. No okay, season. next Watch question. Why we still be losing? <laughs> okay, this is a trick question. In the New Testament book, in which New Testament book do we read about the angels singing glory to God in the highest on Earth on oh. earth, peace and goodwill towards men. Trick question because the Bible is one book. In which New Testament book do we read of the angels singing glory to God in the highest and on earth peace and goodwill towards men? I don't know, but that one that would have said that, that we need to have a conversation. Okay, that so ain't what I don't hear anything. The answer is the Bible does not state that. It I is Sis said that. Marlon said that. Marlon said that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That's not in the Bible. That's a song. Okay. Also, you said that. Okay, I'll give Marlon the point since these is so far ahead. I apologize. Good call, Ooh. Marlon. Okay. How many magi does the Bible say worship baby Jesus in presenting? Was so that people? four magics, five magics, or six magics? Magi. Three. That is incorrect. What? Go freaking say Magi or? just means no, not the gifts. Magic. Not the gifts. How many, how many magis? magis? Wait, how many magis make a magi? 
one. Okay, so I'm gonna go with four <laughs> magis. Incorrect. Anna, do you gotta guess or you gonna just leap on Theus's team? I know not. Okay. The answer is no number is given. Okay, this is a good one. Next question. Which that was a question with no answer. I think we should throw that uh, one out. No, I I really, I I really do. I'm not throwing away because most people will say three like Marlon did. I'm like, no, that's just every movie ever made. No, no number is ever given. So, so, so then I could be right. So, Bo Frankenson and Murr. Those were the gifts. Those are the kings. No, those oh, were the gifts. The no. The kings, uh, even I gave, that one. the kings each gave frankincense, myrrh, and no, gold, the magi gave it. All right, well, anyway, if <laughs> okay, no wait, number wait, was given, up. if no number was given for the magi, then that means all of us are correct. It could be a minimum of three or could be a hundred, but no. So no, then we said, are all correct said, because you cannot said, prove no, any of us wrong. That is incorrect. No number is given. No. Which means any no, number is correct. Given. No. Every number is correct because you don't know what's wrong. We are not giving y'all points for that. No number is given. What is the name? This is a multiple choice. It's only two answers. I mean, one answer, but two choices. What is the name of the leader who ordered the execution of young boys in the gospel? Aaron. That is correct. And I didn't even have to say the answer. Herod is the correct answer. Because he liked them boys. Aaron? Herod. You, you might be oh, thinking okay. of Pharaoh. Pharaoh just wanted to kill all the Hebrew children. That's Herod. Old Testament. Yeah, that's Old Testament. Herod was just like, I don't care whatever race they are, just get them. As long as they because he was told by his advisors that the Savior would be born boy. and it would be a boy. Now, yeah. if you pay attention, though, the story as that part of Herod chasing down all baby boys is eerily familiar when you compare to how Moses, his story began. So it's really interesting how these stories were adopted by certain retellings. It's pretty cool. And we want to thank Bishop for his sermon today because that was just Elevated to a bishop now. Went yeah. from reverend to bishop. I gotta get a hat. I gotta get a hat. No, you're not getting a hat. Next I want a question. Hat. What was the name of the prophetess that prophesied over baby Jesus? Was it A, Elizabeth, B, Anna, C, Margaret? Oh, it was me. It was yes, me. Anna, that is correct. Her name was Anna. What was the name of Mary's cousin who was pregnant with John the Baptist? Elizabeth. Well, that's a correct. She was married to Fred. Wasn't Mary's mother's last name, name Sanford? M? <laughs> no, we don't know what Mary's mother's name was. Oh. Just like we don't know what Jesus' brother's name is. No, we don't know none of his siblings. We just know he had them, and he was the oldest. Sound a lot I like two. James was supposed to be one of them. Some people think James, some people think Judas, some people think um Jude. Uh, See, it can be uh, Judas. I'm yeah. just telling her what some people think. I'm not sitting here saying true or false. I'm just telling her what people have their minds. Some people say there were three magi, and some people say there were five magi, and some people say no, there were 50. no, 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 no. Okay. Silent night, holy night from the carol Silent Night. Just as we don't know the date, we do not know the time of Jesus' birth. What extra biblical source began the tradition of Jesus being born at night? Because as the old ladies say, I was born at night, not last night. And that come from that depth. The shepherds were following the North Star. Uh, no, Marlon. It ain't nothing about a star. The question, the answer is the 
apocrypha, and I will spell it A P O C R Y P H A. It is known as the Catholic Bible. Some people know. Okay, so now there's a whole nother Bible out there. Okay, but anyway. Or we can go by you're following the North Star to find Jesus. No, 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 no. We can come at night. But but see, Marlon, that's the misconception. It's not that it was the North Star. It was a star that, that God had made shine brighter to lead towards them. And we just okay, assume it's a North Star. Right. But, but the I reason we assume he was born at night is because that is where TV. Santa Claus makes his rounds. Oh, we adopted again. Santa Claus couldn't do that at 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Okay. Next all question. Time, Prove, me wrong. Right. Prove me wrong. Where in Israel was Jesus born? Where, a Street. And where in Israel was Jesus born? On 8th Street. Y'all not going to get this one? Bethlehem. Thank you, Marlon. More time here. I was going to say in the manger. That was right, too. But the answer is the main. Uh, now I'm saying it. <laughs> and technically, it is called Judea, but it's Bethlehem of Judea. But I will accept Bethlehem. Mark, Matthew two verse one is where I'm getting that from. Okay. So where was the manger? We gonna get some manger questions again. Okay. In, in, in Bethlehem, I'm with you, Theus. Just saying. And then weren't they on the outskirts? So maybe they weren't quite inside the city limits. Was it incorporated uh, or non-incorporated? Luke, because that matters. According to Luke, where did May where did Mary place Jesus to rest after his birth? In a borrowed tomb. Oh in no, a wait. A manger? That'd be the main It also borrowed that. I said that. Oh, you said I'll give you the points too, but there is no point for you. What? You can't take points from me. I didn't take none. I'm just not giving you none. Oh, but I was right. Okay, here's one. I know this is going to know it. What does the name Jesus mean? Wait a minute. I don't know this one. What does the name Jesus mean? Is it A, God with us? That one. B, wait a minute, there's another choice. Or does it mean B, he shall save his people from their sins? A, because he showed up, left us in slavery for 400 years. A, the other one. A. I will give you both A, but actually you could have said either one and I would have accepted. And he wasn't even named Jesus. He was named Emmanuel. That's funny how y'all could take a whole paragraph and give it a yeah. name. And people, we, we're trying to educate the children today. We're trying. I'm just, I'm just here. Hey, I'm y'all gather Lord, around. Our Lord and Father has come down to bless the earth, and the earth was good, but we named it Joe. Next question. That's because when we adopted it, Marlon. When the angels announced to the shepherds the birth of Jesus the Savior, they said in Luke 2.11, for there is born to you this day in blank a Savior who is Christ the Lord. And everybody just jumped for this. Oh, I'll oh, say oh, it again. Oh, oh, when the the angels announced to the shepherds the birth of the Savior, they said in Luke 2, chapter 2, verse 11, for there is born to you this Day in blank a savior. Bethlehem. A child. A child? Mm -hmm. No. It's born in something. So close. You are so, so born cool. in something. So she's asking for a location. A Bethlehem yeah. again? No. Okay, Amazing. I'm gonna give y'all Bethlehem, but the actual answer is City of David. There wasn't okay. no place called what City of David, though. No. Bethlehem is also known as the City of David. That is... Man, Atlanta's David. also oh. known as Alana, but you know what I'm saying? It ain't fair to ask somebody Okay, that. Matthew 1, <laughs> verse 21 states that these words were spoken to Joseph in his dream. 
She should. Well, wait a minute. We already did. She that. cheating on you, dog. No. No, not that one, because we don't want to. You know they were saying that after he left, though, right? I dare you to go to somebody and be like, "Baby, I'm pregnant," and you ain't never had. Okay. With that person. Which angel? Which angel appeared to Joseph? to inform him not to fear for his wife, Mary, would conceive right. a child by the Holy Ghost. So it wasn't Gabriel. It was the other one. David? No. no. There was another Ooh. angel that was normally like the enforcer, but I can't remember his name. I don't remember. What was it? The answer is the name of the angel is not given. Joseph's angel is not given. Mary's is. Oh okay, so we we go we ain't we ain't going we ain't going to uh inspect the fact that this story is falling apart around the edges now. Right. Makes perfect sense to me. Next question. <laughs> Next question. <laughs> what is the name of John the Baptist's father? Joe. Nah, I can't remember what his name was. What was his name? Um, cause he was old and he was like, wait a minute, how about to get? How, get her pregnant we both old man we can't have no kids and he said you know i'm gonna make so you can't even talk no more that's how so that's how gangster. that question because that is a question but i'll eliminate that's that. just so gangster you know just be like you know you don't believe me you can't talk no more you know that that's some jacked up stuff, okay man. but can you name? answer the question please oh uh, john the old baptist <laughs> no it was mike the presbyterian I'm oh. gonna get this name right, so I'm gonna Chris the agnostic. Hezekiah. Hezekiah Walker. No. <laughs> Jeff Clyber. Is he old enough? Should have been up it there was, by now. It was T D. T D Jakes. T D Jakes. It was definitely <laughs> we had to be. He had to be there. Okay, the name of John the Baptist Jesus. The name of John the Baptist Joel, father was Joel. Zechariah. Z E C H A R I A H. Oh, Zachariah. 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 Yeah. Now what I said. <laughs> no, you oh, did not say that. <laughs> you probably came close to it though. The other no, because Zachariah is also known by the name of Joe Osteen. And the next question. <laughs> I'm sticking to my I'm sticking to my name. My son baptized Jesus. You can't vote me out. Sit down. And I walk with Martin Luther King. <laughs> Uphill both ways in the snow. Okay. Okay, let's get this. Okay, so that's actually the end of our questions. <laughs> See, we behave. Oh, okay, that did not behave, old John the Baptist. How you go? <laughs> so here's the total of the points so far. I haven't added them to the old points. We got these came out of the um her game was 50. 90, he had 90 in this round. Marlon had 60, and Anna had 40. How in the world did I get 40? You got four right. I don't know how you get. You got four right. I only remember getting one right, and that was totally by chance because I said, oh, yeah, that was me. I thought you said the answer about You were shocked on that one. <laughs> So you, I can take him away. I'm just trying to sure. figure out how I only got 90. I swear I was right a lot. No, 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 no. So now we're going to play the next game. Song Association. Good, because I bet Oh, here's where I lose. Now for the next start group of questions, the Book of Islam. This song oh. was sung by John. There's John no question. Frank Sinatra's 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 third cousin. I give you a word, <laughs> and you have to. This time, you do have to sing at least about ten seconds of the song. Ten whole seconds. 
Mm. Mm. That's a long time. Mm. That's, a long That's longer time. than some courses on the song. Y'all want me to take it down to five? For your you sake, might yeah. want to once I get to sing. Okay. Okay. You have to sing a portion of the song that we know which song that you're talking about. Okay. So I will oh, give wow. I will give the person the word if they need help. They will get minus five points, but if they get it, they'll get another 10 points. So you can get 10 points if you just automatically know it, but if you ask for help, that's minus five points. And of course, if, you don't, don't know, know. if you don't know it at all, you get zero. So it's zero, five, 10. 10 if you could just name it right off the bat and sing it. Five if you ask for help. Zero if you just don't even try it. First song choice goes to Marlon. Marlon, your word is silent. S I L E N T. Silent night. Uh oh, listen to that man. Oh, look at that. Look at that. All is calm. It's a cigar. All is bright. Sing it, baby. Drown your virgin. Uh, okay. And why did you not start off with in my mind? I don't know, but you just because went that's not the spot start a silent night. That is temptations. People stop that. No, stop well, it. it's not no, saying that the song is called in my mind. It is not called in my mind. It is called that's what I mind. call. Mary okay, Anna, your song is. Who's this for? Oh, no, who this um, for? Anna, you're well, this may not be all religious songs. Winter. Winter is with an F. The winter wonderland. Walking in the winter wonderland. That is correct. Okay, Anna's got 10. So this, your word is wonderful. Wonderful. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I got this one. Hmm. It gotta be a Christmas song. Yes, it has to be a Christmas song. I'm gonna get a zero on this, man. I don't, I don't know no wonderful. Okay, Marlon, help yeah. me out. Wonderful time. Yeah, I was thinking, Jesus, what a wonderful child. But yeah, Marlon, you right too. But you ain't sing right. nothing. He ain't sing nothing. I sing nothing. Okay, okay, that was your help to get five points at least. I don't need no points. I'm gonna lose this round, bro. I already know. <laughs> okay, it's so we're not getting a point. Okay, I just came here so I didn't get fined. <laughs> the next song of song word is for Marlon. Um, the next word is slay. Lay bells ring, and are you listening? Okay. I don't know the words of that song, but I know the song. The lane, snow is listening. A beautiful time, running the night, walking Walk in the winter, winter okay. wonderland. I'll say that word for Thea. So, Anna, your next word is tree. T R E E, tree. I don't even know this one. Oh, the um, hang on, hang on. Is that tree like Jamaican tree or tree? tree as in Christmas tree. Oh, Christmas tree. Oh, there you go. And I just oh, wow. I, 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 had, I had nothing. This is some song that you singing around the Christmas tree or something like that. Your word is holy. H O L Y. Oh, holy night, the stars are brightly shining. Why are you singing like you're drunk? Is it? Um, I mean, <laughs> okay, so oh, yeah. now when you look back here. I say, I say, when you when you look back and you and you see the stars are shining, oh, oh, 
Marlon, your word is king. K I N G S. All right. Remember the word tree. We tree king. Tree king. <laughs> There's two songs I'm thinking of that have the word kings in them. Did, do, are you going to ask for help or just give it I up? I just gave it to you. He's uh, not saying anything. Give me, give me some help because I'll okay. take the five points. There's We Three Kings. So we Orient. Three Kings. We Three yeah. Kings. And then the Hallelujah song by um, Man, um, Mandel. Handel. Handel's Messiah. I don't know Handel's about that Messiah. One. But I was like, he ain't going to know that one. But three, We Three Kings of Orient. Nope. Don't know. Anna, your next word is drummer. Drummer. Little drummer boy. Oh, rum, 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 rum. <laughs> Me and my drum. There you go. That's all I know, too. That is literally the most. That's to the Charlie Brown song. That is the most depressing song, Christmas song I out there. Actually, love that. Song. Yeah, I'm like, I actually love no, it. it. No, it's just the beat of it. Me and my drum. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it does sound a little sad at the end. But, like, but, but nothing can beat the Charlie Brown song that's supposed to be played only for Christmas, but I listen to it every year, but still it is the most okay. impressive song. This is your word. If you don't get this, I'm going to take points. You're not going to stop this punishment. I ain't got one yet. Yes, you did. You did. You got two. You, you did. got you two. Got two. You got two. The word is all a l l all around the christmas tree how much fun it's gonna be this christmas that is something i thought you was gonna go caroling through the night i thought you was gonna go with mariah's carry all i want for christmas is you but you did oh i got that all i want for christmas no wait Christmas, so tell me what you gonna get your boy. I want a big Cadillac. Okay. I want some five and I want a Marlon, big coat. Your word. That's a Christmas song. That's a Christmas song. A Christmas song. Your word, Uncle Luke, is Santa Claus. Want a little bit of that. <laughs> want a little bit of that. Santa Claus is coming to town. Oh, yeah. Santa Claus is coming to town. Santa Claus is coming to town. Without them, there will be no new edition. <laughs> How do you yeah. mute somebody else? You can't. Only I can mute. And that is a true statement, Marlon. You know good and well. They was Jackson 5 light. No Good diet, Jackson Five. <laughs> oh, wait, well, well, they on a diet, so let's give them this. Okay, and your word is black man. That ain't no word. That's two words. What? That's two words. Your two words are black man. Man, you setting her up. You you get her because she's like, is that what this is? Is that what this is? <laughs> no, I'm not setting her up. I think she might know it. <laughs> I'm a black man and I don't know it. <laughs> black man. Okay, so Anna, are you going to answer? I just want to hear what the answer is now. I don't even care if she gets it. <laughs> okay, so Anna. We just found a mean streak in Tracy right there, boy. Mean streak. I thought she would have got Santa Claus as a black man. Look at you. Look at her. She just went Black Panther on her own show. Santa Claus is a black man. That's a real song. That's, Nobody knows Santa that's Claus. That's a song? Is a real song? Yeah. No, that's a no, song. No. Okay. Oh, no. YouTube. And, 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 Go YouTube. Yeah. The weird thing is, I thought of those words, but I'm like, that can't possibly be a song. Yes, it's a real song. Santa Claus is a black man. Santa Claus is. Yes, a real that's... song. Wow. Tracy came up in one of them revolutionary churches. 
I guess so. Oh my God, the cover killed me. Yep, see, I ain't lying. It's a real song. I, I, I need to go hear this now. See, I see Santa Claus is a black man. Your he's a black is. man. Call him Santa Claus. You should, if you see the album cover itself, you should know that that they was. I don't come that. down no chimney because that ain't for me. I'm gonna kick in your front your door and fill your no. tree. I'm a black it's man. O W. <laughs> Why are you gonna kill the tree? No, I'm gonna <laughs> fill up the tree. I'm gonna give you presents. I don't just your you word the is no, Theus. Snow. I don't know why Snow White is what's in my head right now. Um, <laughs> let us know, let us know, let us know. I like cocaine. I um, like. No, we're not going to talk about cocaine. Powder sugar. Okay. What That's just happened? snow, right? In the snow. What? Oh, I know. Informer, you know there's no man on the play. I get your boom boom down. Let's just do this one. It's gonna be the last one. On? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, Marlon. I think these has had something to drink. I did. I had a V I had a, a V8 energy before we started. <laughs> okay, look, because I don't recall what that means, it looked really oh, inappropriate. Oh, oh so <laughs> <laughs> oh. Okay, hold on a second. It made me think about the conversation from before the video started. <laughs> y'all, y'all be trying to. I'm just y'all gotta watch out for them dry bones. Okay. So the the story was that a little girl actually was being kidnapped, and she just that means really help. calmly. This means help. If you ever see someone. Just pounding the fist with the thumb up. That means help. That got that little girl safe. No, that's awesome. And that's powerful. Well, story. Yeah. But if I had seen that, I wouldn't have known. And I just would have been confused. Anna, what's the one? Because I saw a video of it. And the whole premise was the girl was being. Marlon, we're not talking about videos. Yeah. Uh, no, the, the girl was getting abused by the boyfriend. The boyfriend took her for a ride. And she gave some kind of hand gesture, a silent hand gesture to the police of saying, yes, she needs help. And it was something real quick, like, but I can't really remember what it was. Yep, and we're going to go to the next song. I was trying to get everybody off that earlier conversation we was having. So, okay. I was trying to go the opposite. Well, your word is no. K-N-O-W. Who's whose question is this? Marlon is your word. <laughs> oh. <laughs> the word is no. K N O W. Destiny's child sang this song. I'm just saying. No, 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 no. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, Christmas song. Yeah, 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 yeah. If I say it, oh, you go like oh, K N O W. Yes. Yeah. K N O W. Yeah, like Mary, don't you? Yeah. Oh, I, 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 I was going to get it, so I don't count that as help. I was going to get it. I was just putting the words together. That doesn't count as help because the host would have been the one to give you help for the to count against uh, okay. you. Yep, I didn't ask if you want help, so if you know the yep. song, now would be a good time to sing it. Mary, did you know? And of course, she did, did know. Well, did mind know. That, but yes, that is correct. CeeLo Green, best part. CeeLo, best one. You mean best version? Best version. Cause that's an old song. Did you? Okay, and I was also should have been talking to Joseph, cause he the one to need to know. Um, I was also <laughs> thinking of do they know it's Christmas time by um those British singers, and they all Nobody got to about like that. The US. It was like right before we are the world. It was right. Before, it was with George Michael and Elton John. I'm like all the British singers. They got together and did like a USA. Tracy, 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 Tra Tracy. Oh come Tracy. on, y'all got it. Tracy, not our music. Tracy, Tracy. You don't listen to British artists. Uh, who is oh, that? Yeah, Elton John, British, right? Sure. 
But they yeah. did. They did their own like chairs. They had so the monkeys, right? Weren't they? And it weren't was they called, do they yeah. know it's Christmas? Beatles, uh, Rolling Stones, Elton John. Next and last song goes to well, England. The last song. The Pet Shop goes, Boys, were they, were they English? That's Australian, isn't it? Yeah, they were Australian, oh. I think. Um, last song goes Austria. to Anna. A different set of colonizers. Got it. Wish. W-I-S-H. Don't order from there because your stuff don't ever come back right. <laughs> ever. <laughs> ever. Get you a baby doll from Wish and you'll have nightmares for life. But like that, like that meme I, I shared, Psalms 91 calms it right down. <laughs> <laughs> Woo. These dolls might move at night, but just you know. Okay. Okay, Anna, I know you got it. Wait, wait, what was her word? Wish. W I S H. So like when you like wish upon a star. Yeah, but that's not a Christmas song. That's not a Christmas song. Christmas song. Well, makes no difference. That's not a Christmas song. That's Disney, ain't it? Yes. Yeah. Okay. How did you and not Disney know is Christmas. Disney. Okay, help. Okay, one of y'all help her because if I do it, she's gonna lose five points. If I help her, she's gonna get it wrong. If, if I help her, we're gonna sit here silent for another 10 15 okay. minutes. Okay, here it is. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry uh, Christmas. We wish you a oh. Merry Christmas. Can you tell which one of us don't sing these songs every year? I'm telling oh. you, man. I ain't, I, I'm I'm drawing blanks over here. Hey, I'm, I'm dead serious. And that was. And that I've was never old seen that. Song out there. We wish you a mm. no. That's an old song, but I oh it, I know it. it. Popped in my head. Mm. I mean, we sang it in elementary school. That's the best I can give yeah. you. We wish. I Give can't speak for everybody else's family, but we didn't really you know, gather around singing Christmas songs um, except for In My Mind. Yep, and that's what the songs are called. <laughs> In My Mind. I don't know why. It's Christmas. And Donnie Hathaway's song. What was it? All over the world tonight. Okay, this is going to be what real close. I'm calculating the points, everybody. There's a long way of saying Marlon won. <clears throat> okay, coming in at third place is Anna with 105 points. Coming in in second place is Theus with 170 points. Told you. And unfortunately for us, coming in at first place with a whopping 230 points, Marlon. Yep, well, Judge's favorite. And I were on the team. Well, I had to count y'all separately. <laughs> I tried it's okay. It. I I was just here to have a good time. Me too. And, um, I, I really don't care about winning or losing. You know, so Marvel will get my prize, which is absolutely nothing. But <laughs> he'll, get he'll still break it. Mm. He'll get bragging rights in 2023 coming up or for the show he's doing tomorrow. So congratulations, Marlon. Who's doing the show tomorrow? Oh, God, today is Friday. Oops. Yes, today yeah. is Friday. <laughs> Since it's game night, which would make tomorrow <laughs> Saturday, which would mean it'd be <laughs> Saturday night. I thought we weren't recording this. We recording this weekend? Yeah. Yes, we. we go. I think this this weekend was the last at weekend first, of the year. At first, we were supposed to have two weeks off at the end of December. Last year, I we didn't do nothing at the end of December. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I'm 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 doing a show tomorrow and Sunday. Y'all are happy to right. uh, um, invited you know, to come on. We're coming. You but know. I'm not doing anything after that. As a matter of fact, the week after, all I'm doing is a whole bunch of recordings to be dropped on the week that I am off. Because unfortunately, I have to go to Florida. Yeah, so Marlon is on I'm tomorrow. So sorry, bro. 
Um, so Marlon says we know you can we can find you on Saturday Night Fives and um, Radical Truth to Power. Give us more detail about your where how to find you. Yeah, that covers it. You'll I see know, what you She kind of nailed that one. <laughs> that pretty much it. <laughs> okay, I, I wanted you to say it, not me. Okay, Steve. Okay. You will find me tomorrow on Saturday Night Vibe at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and Radical Truth to Power this Sunday at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Please tune in because it is the last show of the year. Anna, where can we find you? It's the most wonderful time of the year. The Anna, wonderful. where can we find you at? I, I'm actually going to take this time to please ask everybody to go to patreon.com slash a better tracing media. She really needs some support. She has some really big dreams that she wants to accomplish. She needs some help. Besides, you would get to come and join on fun little things like this. So please, please. Thank you. I come and drop knowledge. Yeah. I we were gonna run away with the Bible trivia. I'm like, this is gonna smash this. He did run away with the Bible trivia. I did trivia. great with he, I did good did. with Bible yeah, trivia. I'm paying you a compliment. I'm paying you a compliment. Oh, I thought you were saying oh, okay. I didn't need all the diet A little backhanded, but you know. No, it's not backhanded. <laughs> you simply mean that. And tell us where the we can thesis, find it. The thesis from Theus on the Bible. <laughs> I went from I went from what was a pastor to a bishop, <laughs> yep, a reverend to a bishop. Oh, oh, and did, was I ever a deacon? I don't know if I got to be. I a didn't deacon. call you that. Oh, no. I never got to be a deacon. That's a great name, Deacon Deacon Theus. My what if your name was, was deacon, deacon and then you okay, got involved so in the church? But I never. But a hey, question. My grandfather was a deacon, but I, I actually don't know what that means. Can you explain a little? Deacon is like an officer of the church. They typically do things like your auxiliary your auxiliary things, like they oversee the women's commit um groups that they that are run. So even yeah. though the women are running it, the, there's always a deacon over it. Then you got the finance committee, they're usually over that. Okay. And then and this is in the Baptist church, I mean, and then you got like who who ushers in the spirit each morning and gets the gets the business of the church moving is is also the deacon but really they sit in the corner and go to sleep but okay, um, so i was gonna say something totally and different and wear the same suits and please my answer is, is, is that in the when the church first 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 started the work of the apostles was way too much and they couldn't serve people and preach so they decided to get deacons to help them out and so if you would read like the book of Acts, you'll find that a lot of deacons were also preachers. That's about the easiest way I can just kind of explain it. Now we just call them junior ministers and, and they fill in oh. so the pastor can take a break. Yes, but in the beginning they gotcha. were preachers. Now they're just whatever. But Thea, Thank tell you. us where we can find you, please. They're basically middle, middle management. Yeah, pretty much. They're the supervisors. Yeah. They're supervisors. Thank you. Yeah. It's still hourly though. Right. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, it goes like yes, this. Right there. Come check me out. Complexsimpleman.com. Um, you'll see all of our content, uh, a lot of my own content, and some excellent information on public service things that we're trying to do. So check me out there. Thank you. Okay, everybody, remember I'm doing a New Year's Eve show December 31st at 11 o'clock p.m. I go live on YouTube. We're going to be there one hour. I'm going to be in there, out there. Boom, I'm going to talk about the highlights of 2022. He was coming for 2023, and I said I had an announcement. Uh, um, this is for a Patreon exclusive. You're going to have to be a Patreon member to get this new show it is a limited yeah. series called tracy buys a house oh is that like are you gonna have like Ooh. digital playing cards tracy buys a house is a limited a series man. that will take my journey into home ownership i will start from Whoa. the lending process and all the way until i move into my new home that will start 
hopefully the very first week of January. And remember um, to visit my website at tracymediallc.com where you can find all this information. Again, thank you to all the 100 people that finally got me over. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you yeah. 10 million times. 150 is now the goal. We're 50 away from 150. We'll see you all. This is the last Friday game night until 2023. So we will not be back next week. Okay. Um, the Tracy show ended on Tuesday. That was the last of that. And of course, my last, the Saturday show taping is tomorrow. Have a great evening. Wait, 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 wait. Don't turn it off yet. Mm. So everybody out there, uh, semi-serious moment, really a serious message though. If you really stop and think about it, Tracy is building something. She is very passionate, as you can tell. She's very patient. She's very knowledgeable. What you saw here is us having fun. This game night, this is what we do. Yeah. But she also drops knowledge and brings people to the fore so that their voices can be heard. Now, I would, I would like for you to please subscribe to her page. It is 100% free. Only takes a few moments. I mean, you got all kinds of pages you don't even go back and look at. So stop being stingy with your, with your, subscri your subscriptions. But more importantly, please go to her Patreon. I don't care if you do a two or a three dollar uh, commitment, but definitely I say do five. It's once a month, folks. Once a month, five dollars. I'm sure you can do it. I'm asking you to please do it. Um, that was my plug. Uh, if I don't see y'all before then, uh, Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, uh, Happy Kwanzaa, uh, Feliz Navidad. Uh, happy Eyes, Happy um, Festival of Colors. Yes. Happy Yule, Happy Solstice. Yes. yes. All that. All that. All of them. Whatever makes you and your family yes. happy, be happy. Just share love. Yes, be happy. Definitely be happy. Hmm. But again, everybody, again, you do not know how much this 100 means to me. It means everything to me because it, it took a while, but I got there and we're going to stay there because 150 is next. Thank you, everybody. Be on the lookout for the limited series. And I'll have a major, major announcement. And I'll probably do it on my birthday. I'm not quite ready to let it out the bag just yet. But I'll probably do it around my birthday or on my birthday. But just keep tuned to the channel. And we'll talk to you all later. Have a good evening. Say goodbye, everybody. Bye, everybody.